Hey y'all, welcome back to the Dominican Route. Real quick, I wanted I want y'all to give me y'all opinion on this video right here. I'm about to show you this video. Check this video out. Let me know what you think about it. I'm gonna give you my personal opinion on what I think the American politicians are saying when they say African Americans be careful or don't go to the Dominican Republic. Check this video Thank out. Raise the Do you think that the actual government for the Dominican Republic is racist? Yes or no? The actual the government of the Dominican Republic? Uh, no, we have concerns about the treatment of uh, the Haitian population, but the, the government, no. But then, Mr. Secretary, you have told the African Americans in this country not to travel to the island, and that happened last November. We had a, uh, we had a security concern, and my, my number one responsibility, besides looking out for my own people, is making sure, looking out for Americans. We worked with the government of the Dominican Republic repeatedly, well in advance of putting that notice out. Uh, to try to address the concerns that had been raised, uh, but we got to a point where we felt it was important to make sure that uh, uh, people could people look out for, for their safety. For you to put screen. a travel ban and affect their economy, tourism specifically, mm -hmm. it has to. You need to have some proof. Mm -hmm. And Chairman McCall and myself, mm -hmm. we've asked the State Department to provide that proof, mm -hmm. and you have not provided any. So, having said that, you have the power to retract that ban. Are you planning to do that anytime soon? We will do it on uh, based when? on the facts. I can't know. Well, but that's what I'm saying. The fact we have been okay. asking for you to prove to us, Chairman McCall and myself, mm -hmm. to provide the, the evidence that proves that the Dominican Republic government is affecting African Americans, and you guys have not provided anything. Uh, we'll look to see what information we have that we You don't have share. any because I've been asking you, and you have not provided. Uh, I mean, again, you, the, your the, department. These determinations are made, and, and, and we worked with the, with the government of the Dominican Republic to try but to address by when them do you think that you will make a decision whether to keep the ban or to retract. It, it depends entirely on the, on, on the facts, whether... Uh, there are no steps, facts? Uh, well, there are so, facts. Okay, why don't we do something? Was made. Why don't you then provide to Chairman McCall and myself the facts that prove to you, to the State Department, that the Dominican Republic is really affecting African Americans? Can so, we... By the way, it's, it's, it's also not a travel ban. It's an alert. Yeah, an alert means it's, it's the should... same effect, my friend. Well, it's affecting a lot there were, of. There were, multiple, that there were multiple government. cases of concern, which I'm, I'll make sure we share with you. Please do. Could you please share that with us? Yeah. Could you commit that? We you will share, share the cases the of concern Thank that raise the. So I was trying to figure out, like, hmm, why are they only talking about African Americans? They don't recommend that African Americans go to the Dominican Republic. So I processed it. I, they gotta be. Oh yeah, look, look. Lizzie, thank you so much. She did my nails. My look, I use it. That's probably my second time in my life getting my nails. All right, done, but I'm getting my birthday started early. Lizzie is giving me. Uh, come on, say this, say. Manicula. Manicula. <laughs> Manicuri. Come on, say this. Manicura. Manicura. Yes. Okay. I think I'm gonna get uh, pink. No. No, no baby. <laughs> but anyway. So I was thinking, I was like, wow, why are they saying that? Why did they put that out? And that was about three or four months ago, I guess. But I just saw the video for the first time. So the only thing I can think of is that they don't know what the hell they're talking about. There's no danger here or nothing like that. The only thing I can process is they need to say dark skin Americans. That's the only thing I can think of. They need to say dark skinned Americans. Because I'll give you an example. I picked up a friend of mine about two weeks ago at the airport. And the Dominican police pulled us over. They were just flagging people down like they usually do in the Dominican Republic. I don't have no problem with that. I'm not against that. Hey, it's their country. I respect their country. That's fine. So long story short, they look at him He's dark skinned. He's like Wesley Snipes dark skinned, Mississippi burning, Lee Robe dark skinned. So uh, they, we rolled the windows down, and they kind of, they, they kind of look at him. I rolled the windows down, and I said, "Grab your passport and show it to him." And then he said, "Okay." He said, "Should I just give him my whole wallet, 
or should I just give him my passport? And I said, no, pull your passport out and just give him your passport. By the time I said that, they tapped on the window on the side of the door. We had the windows rolled down and they was listening to our conversation and they just told us to leave. So what does that tell you? He was dark skinned. They knew my light bright ass was Dominican or American or something. So my point is behind all of that, they saw a dark skinned guy on the passenger side. They wanted to make sure he wasn't Haitian. So they're not targeting African Americans. They just want to make sure that you're not Haitian. They want to see your paperwork. That's all that I see. So this, I don't know where America got this from, these politicians saying, there's be careful, there's a ban on, uh, you know, they don't recommend that African-Americans go. I don't have no problems. I've, for three years, I've never had a problem with, with any type of Dominican. So um, just use your common sense. That's the only thing I, I, I say, you know, you don't, I walk at night, I walk in the street at night, Amongst the Dominicans, I don't have no problem. I don't know. I don't know. Come on, Gracias a Dios. Tengo una picazón en el caco que ya no lo voy. Sí. La cebolla. Sí, sí. It's really disturbing for the politicians to come out and say African Americans don't go to the Dominican Republic. They don't recommend that you go to the Dominican Republic. You just saw the video. So just give me your thoughts on it. What do you feel about that? I, I, they need to say, they need to just say dark skinned African Americans. That's what they need to say. Dominican are really like rounding up illegal Haitians. They need to say exactly what they're trying to do. What's going on? They're not out here just trying to jump on African Americans in the Dominican Republic. That's a lie. They need to say that. They need to say exactly what's going on. Y'all comment. Let me know. Let me know what you think. So I'm gonna get off my soapbox, but uh, hey, I keep on looking at my nails. Yeah, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Anyways, God bless. May peace be still. Make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell. See you later. I'm tired. I'm going to sleep.